This is our story. Let's see who's up next. Connor. I love playing Connor's chapters. All right, so he's back in what we think might be like a software realm or a mind palace or a server or something because you've got these weird bits that are all unfinished, all very virtual worldy. But why is there rain in the virtual world? And who is this Amanda person? Is she some master AI computer system who we are designed to interlink with? Because remember, Connor is a prototype, right? He's built specifically for investigating deviant androids and he's slowly becoming deviant himself. Best boy, huh? Yeah. The name's Amanda, I think, wasn't Hello, it? Amanda. Yep. Hi, I've been expecting you. Trusted. Would you mind a little walk? All right, let's do it. Umbrella and everything. Why is there rain in your virtual world, Amanda? Are you sad? That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. A pity you didn't manage to capture it. Oh, rude. Well, we had to save Hank, that's why. Deviants are completely irrational, which makes it difficult to anticipate their behavior. But I should have been more effective. Did you manage to learn anything? Yes, this deviant cared for, um... Oh, there's a clue we didn't get. Damn it. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. You came very close to capturing that deviant. Hmm. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? We're becoming friends. He saved him. He seemed grateful that I saved his life on the roof. He didn't say anything, but he expressed it in his own way. What? We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this, whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Okay. Why are you so harsh? Do you know likey poor Connor? That's alright, we like Hank more anyway. So we'll find out Amanda's deal at the end. Oh, he's blinking a bit too. Thank you for the hint, Elvin. I look forward to getting more answers at the end. <laughs> you have reached your destination. Thank you for traveling with Detroit Taxi. We look forward to seeing you again soon. Okay, we step out. Are we at Frank's house now, maybe? Sorry, Hank's house. We've reached the status of friend. We've sort of learnt that to gain Hank friendship points, we need to not be a dick to him and we need to try and listen to him. Um, most of the time. I mean, I don't want to listen to him all the time because he tells us to wait in the car, but... Lieutenant Anderson! Oh, he's not going to like Anybody being woken home? up. Time to break in! We can ring the doorbell again, or we... <laughs> if we break in, that will upset him, right? So let's not break in. Oh, yeah, that'll do. Just hold the button. So, yes, the graphics are amazing in this game. Um, they're even more impressive on the 4K uh, recordings that I'm putting on YouTube as well. Oh, we have to break in. <laughs> That's just going to piss him off. He's not going to like being broken. Oh, can we do something with his car? Oh, his phone's in the car, is it? What can we do with the car? Can we... Nothing apart from looking at the car. It's on the other side. 
Go around the house? Alright, we'll do that. Thanks, Elvin. But he's going to be pissed from all the ringing. Yeah, I know, but he'd still be more grateful for the fact that we didn't break into his house, I would have thought. All we can do is just look at the car. There's nothing... around this side of the house we've got windows here but i want to try and respect his space creep him out less oh hang on we've got a prompt the looking prompt oh there's a doggo sumo sumo the saint bernard right that's his name yeah that's what i was thinking itchy but it doesn't seem to be anything i can do i can't set off any kind of car alarm from what i can tell all i can do is walk i can't even run all i can do is walk slowly so Let's go around the side of the house, I guess. Let's see what else we can find. Oh, although we didn't look in the other window. Sorry. Let's walk back, look through the other window without breaking in. In case we get another hint of something useful. And we can't see a damn thing. So that is pointless. Come on, Connor, at least do a Commander Shepard old man jog. The car is too old to have an alarm, I agree. Unless it's been retrofitted. Did it have some fancy glowy thing sitting on the dash? I don't know what that was. Okay, there's his own beauty. There's the doggo. Oh, he's unconscious. He's probably just drunk. Oh, uh, we can... I don't have any choice apart from not breaking the window, so... All right. Here we go. Tally-ho. Very smooth. Sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. Yeah. It's probably just drunk, though. Yes, can we pat the doggo? I want to pat him. All right. Come on, Connor. So we were forced to break in. Check on Hank. What else have we got? Can't leave the room until we check on Hank. Yep, that's a gun. <laughs> and some um, Jack Daniels or similar. Okay, what have we got? Let's. One bullet remaining. Were you doing some Russian roulette? Hank, you better not have been. Yep. Scotch whiskey. What have we got here? Slight arrhythmia, but no signs of trauma. Okay. And he is got alcohol in his breath. Big surprise. Lieutenant. Is that like an ethanol-based coma detected, is it? Wake up, Lieutenant. It's me, Whoa. Connor. Whoa. Oh, he's going to love that. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey, you to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. At least he's wearing... Thank you in advance for your cooperation. Some kind of get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Take Hank to the bathroom. All right, that sounds sus. Sumo, attack! <laughs> no, he's not going to attack. He loves us. <laughs> uh, 357 Calimba says um, Vito with the, uh, with the revolver. Fuck, I think I'm going to be sick. Yeah, well, we'll get you in the bathroom so you can be sick, Hank. Go purge! Purge! Cleanse thyself! Oh, you asshole! I'm not going anywhere. Come on, Hank. Cooperate, bruh. I'm not what the hell grumpy. are you doing? <laughs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. <laughs> it's for your own good. Give him some cold water. Oh, wrong way. Wrong gesture. There we go. Ah! Ah! Turn it off! Turn it off! Ah! 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 
You awake now? <laughs> what the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. <sighs> hmm. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> you love it, Hank. Can't you just leave me alone? Unfortunately, I cannot. I've been programmed to investigate this case, and I can't do it without you. I don't give a shit about your goddamn case. Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here. Oops, today. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. <laughs> you know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There it is. <laughs> There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. <laughs> I'll be a good android and go get them, but first I want to read these post-it notes here. And we... We see what they are? So yes, we did the tease for sure, and Vito uh, mentioned that yeah, the the three five seven revolver is a nine point one millimeter revolver. Very cool. Today will be fabulous. Keep smiling. I'm not grumpy. Is that something or not? Anyway, whatever. Let's go. Time to snoop. Yeah. What else can we find in the house? So the Clothes will be in the bedroom. Let's investigate the rest of the house first. Anything for us to look at? Maybe not. Where is Zumo? Okay, we've got uh, basketball on TV. With one android allowed per team. Or something like that we read earlier, right? Can't seem to interact with anything. All right, well... We tried to snoop, not much else we can learn. What's this watch? Hmm. Okay. What do you snoop want to loop. wear? Whatever. Hippie, stripey, or streaky? Ooh, I'm thinking streaky? Streaky. Oh, sorry, Vito. I was too slow. Or too fast, rather. I didn't wait for the response. <laughs> Snoop level fail. Is there more things I could have snooped? Is there... Frosty? Probably. Right, anyway, let's just... Oh, he's in prime purging position. <laughs> Are you all right, Lieutenant? <coughs> yeah, yeah. <sighs> Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Can you do that? <coughs> Learn more. Now we can snoop. President Warren issued an official warning to Russia in her speech to Congress today where she demanded that all Russian troops withdraw from the Arctic region immediately. He likes the jazz. Kremlin has yet to respond, but this is clearly a new escalation in the conflict. Many experts are suggesting... Autumn Blues, Michigan Brothers. Hank loves jazz. Which happens to be one of my more disliked genres, but anyway... Some jazz is good. A lot of it, I don't like. <laughs> oh, so, oh, did he have a son? Ha! Ah. He lost his son. I wonder how. It's going to be a delicate topic with him, so let's not push that one too hard. What else have we got? Sam and the weapon. Question, say nothing. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Hold it. To see how long I can last. Oh, Jesus. Must have collapsed before I found out. 
He was doing. Lucky. The next shot would have killed you. Jesus, Hank. He has suicidal tendencies. Yep. Well, we think we know why now, right? Here he is. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Good doggo. He's a good boy. I want to pat the doggo more. Alright, so... Oh, there's some other snooping we could have unlocked, but we missed it. Oh, he's left for the Eden Club. Um, so we're going to be going to a Android sex club at some stage, I'm guessing. We'll find out how that goes. Most people find the Hank, the picture of Hank's son. Um, yeah, all right, so there's some other stuff. And the majority of people go with the hippie shirt, as suggested by Vito. Okay, calm Hank's dong. 93%. Okay, most people do that. <laughs> You'd hate to be the 7% of people that failed to get along with the doggo. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens next. This is where it all began. The world's forge. The company has allocated a specialized model to assist investigators. How do I know you are not a deviant? They are not machines! I could take you there. Get away! Find telephone! I know someone who can help you. This, this is, is our, our story. story. 